Hey y'all, it's your girl, Eden, and I'm back with another video. And today I'm going to be using my new sewing machine I just got. This little thing. So, today I'm going to be making a pillow. It's going to be a foam pillow. It's going to be like this. This is like the part that I'm going to be sewing together to make a pillow. This part will be where I'm going to be adding my cotton wool. But I have to keep it folded to like, yeah. But right now I'm going to finish sewing my hat because I try sewing it I am using a Coca Cola box to get my pedals. As you can see, I have my earphones in. I do not have the same phone as that. Make sure you go check out my TikTok. I just posted a video before I came to give it to you guys. But we've been able to handle all ourselves. It might be loud. But you guys, it might be. Thank you. 
turn out a little additional space for himself. I really enjoy my creative outlet, so for as part of the house search, it'd be really important to find a house that has a space that I can use for my studio like I can here. And Juan planning to unleash his creativity on other parts of the house. It'd be fun to redo a bathroom or a kitchen or um, do some outdoor work like build a patio or something. I would like to have a house that's more ready. It would be nice to not live in a construction zone. Juan wants a big yard. Ellie wants it to be fenced in for their dog. They both want an open kitchen. Do you want me to try and wash it and salvage it? I don't know. Sorry, maybe we're just eating mangoes tonight. <laughs> we spend a lot of time in the kitchen, and I feel like having that island in the middle is like a sort of essential space to meet and entertain. I think we need a better hood. I feel like with all the cooking we do, I feel like sometimes the house smells a little bit. I don't know if the hood's that important. We hardly ever use this one. Yeah, because not that good. They'd like to stay as close to the city center as possible. I'd like to be somewhere where I can walk to coffee shops, just get out and see people. And that's just really important to me. First stop is a place in the city neighborhood of Mount Hope. Mount Hope's a nice walk in the neighborhood. And I love the style of this house. I love the porch, the bee boarding. I'm going to be honest. It smells like it's nothing that's running on it. You know, but it's a craftsman. It's perfect. I guess the one bad thing is that it's two stories, huh? We'll have yeah. to see how Samantha can deal with that. Yeah, these chairs will be a little tough. Hi there! Hi, Hi Sarah. Sarah! Take a look at this porch! I know, it's beautiful. It's a 1928 bungalow. Okay. okay. Hey guys, I am back so you can see me. The camera went off. So the camera is flipped. Um, dash. So yeah, my camera just shut back on. It shut off. I really seen him, seen him was for fucking Raymond Burke that he came over here. Yeah. Oh, that boy, that boy ain't gonna let him go. Uh, yeah, she put that yeah on him. Yeah, big baby Lucy, he got another little job. If baby was trying to give all the people propane away on his last day of work. Man. <laughs> 